Hi everyone, let's make a parallax bedroom. This won't be in dev tutorial. Kinda of fast, simple room. For in dev tutorial, you can check my other video. So let's go. Let's scale the room to 75, 3 on X and 3 on Y. Let's add a plane for the floor. Let's change the snapping to face. G and with control snap to the face. Let's move it and let's scale it. Control A for apply. Control A apply rotation scale. And let's add a material. So let's go to Acid Browser. I'll use Mad Materials by Parameter Studio. Let's take wood and we actually see how it looks so let's try this one mm -hmm. this one i think i would love black floor i think yeah let's rotate the plane okay this looks good looks good for a front room Let's add one more slot, add a ma basic material and assign it. For the walls, let's go with concrete. Fifth one. Yeah, that's already good. First one and good, looks good. For the back, let's change it to the basic material and for the wall, actually, if we will add a material, oops, if we will add a material, and for example, we can add tiles, we'll have strange effect. It's do parallax room effect, do UVs. So the best option here will be to add a plane. Let's rotate it, let's move it to the wall, and let's scale it. And apply rotation scale. Now we can add, for example, concrete. And I think this abstract one will go really good. Yes. That's what I like. Nice, nice material, a very nice material. I like it. And it has like these points, same as here. So it connects very well. Let's add a lighting. A real light. Let's move it up. And let's scale it a bit. And Shift D, let's duplicate it. And scale too. For the back, let's make it 25. Now let's add a furniture. For the furniture, I will use interior models collection. It actually was updated, plus 70 new models. So let's go by adding a bed, the most important thing in the bedroom. So. Okay. And a sofa maybe? This gray one. So good models. High quality, high quality. And I think chair for the front. Mm-hmm, I think this one. Let's duplicate it and rotate. Hmm. Yeah, somewhere here. Now let's add um, table. 
I think here I would like to see a small table. Okay. And I think here I would like some like cabinet, maybe. Maybe this one here. Hmm. Too many cabinets, I don't know which to choose. <laughs> too many, too many. Let's go with this one and scale on that. Okay. Now let's add a carpet. Decorations, paintings. No, not painting, carpets. Carpets. This one. No. This one. Maybe grayish, no. Let's find a good one. I think this one, yeah. This one looks good. Now let's add a painting. Let's add this one. Let's delete this one and let's place it here. Rotate it on Y and place it here. Looks good. Now let's add some decorations. Clock. Some books and speaker. Let's add a plant. Let's add a lamp. Let's go for ceiling lamps. And let's go for something like this. Move it. Okay. I think one more lamp here I would like to have. Floor lamp. Yeah. This is nice. Let's turn over emission. And I think here too. Let's add one more painting here. Rotate it and scale it. It's not actually a painting, but something cool. Like a poster maybe? And let's add a curtains. Curtains. Scale on that. And let's just scale it on that again. It's a bit bluish, so what I would like to do, I would go to Shader Editor. I would like to add, add Hue Saturation node and make Saturation 0. Yeah, that's good. I think that's it, no? Everything looks good. Maybe let's add a vacuum. An eye robot, maybe. Home appliances, vacuum, this white one, mm. good, okay. Hmm, maybe socket 
here. Yep. Mm -hmm. Maybe somewhere we can add this thing. Not sure where, but yeah, maybe s somehow like this. Yeah, this is good. This is good. Now let's select everything with A. Let's des deselect the main two rooms. And let's put everything with M to the room collection. Curtains to the sprite front. Table and this chair to sprite 2. Plant to sprite 1. And this chair to sprite 3. And now we can parent all objects. Set room scale for render. Let's check how it looks in render view. I would add a little bit more power to lighting. Let's scale lights, more power. Okay, and let's render it, render all. Let's create a cross map. And let's create material and object. Okay, you see this thing here. From what it can be, I'm not sure, but we can fix it by cut out alpha Four, maybe three. Yeah, and we don't have it. And curtain looks much better. Yeah, looks good, I think. We can actually play with this chair, with this, and let's move this one too. We actually can also move it here. But I think here it looks much better. Yeah, that's it. Thank you to Mad Materials and thank you to Interior Models. See you in my next video.